It's soccer season and we got Akron taking on the Ohio State University. Ain't too much need to be said. Let's get right into it. Hey, and the action started early too because five minutes in, Ryan King's first scored off an assist from Shookaluk. Ohio State answered back immediately though. And when I say immediately, I mean immediately. Because literally two minutes later, Owen Sullivan scored, putting Ohio State on the board and making it a tie game. And it was here we knew we had a game on our hands. Hey, and one thing I loved about this game is how intense it was. Like, you could literally feel it in the atmosphere. But it makes sense if you really think about it, though. Because they're both ranked teams pretty evenly matched. Akron gives up a goal early. Ohio State gives up one after. They're not giving up no more goals. Look at the defense from both teams. Both teams kept it up for a while too. Nobody else scored in the first half, but 10 minutes into the second, Ohio State went up 2-1 with a goal by Xavier Green. If I'm being honest, I gotta say at this point in the game, it was a little scary to be an Akron fan because Ohio State just kept attacking and attacking and attacking. So I also gotta say shout out to Mitch Butler because he ain't let nothing in. He really held it down. Hey, and one thing I love to see happen in sports is when one player starts eating and then the rest of his teammates follow. And that's exactly what happened here. You saw how Butler was playing and then Shookaluk takes advantage of that momentum and gets him a goal and ties things back up. When it comes to games like this, one thing that you have to expect is physicality. And let me tell you, this game started to get physical. Both teams started to get into foul trouble, but they didn't let up. They kept playing hard. Now, if I had to pick a favorite moment of this game, it's going to this right here, no question. Stefan Debrevich with a crazy header to put Akron up 3-2 late in the second half. Absolutely insane in a clutch moment, man. Debrevich is him. After that goal, somehow both teams started playing even harder. And you know, like I said, when you play hard, it's going to get a little bit more physical, so... Foul trouble became more of an issue for both teams, and that led up to a red card on Jason Shookaluk, putting Akron down a man and taking one of their best players out. This is a huge moment because it was already a close game, but now the Zips got to play at a disadvantage. From here, the Zips playing with 10 men were able to create a scoring opportunity for themselves, but they don't finish it. So after that, it was all about holding on to their lead but Ohio State had other plans. They scored off a header, tying things up 3-3. From here, the game is pretty much just defense and it ends in a draw. This was Josh with the coverage. Peace.